Okay guys, how you doing out there? My name is Kenneth Bird. I'm the creator of Crystal H Technology Projection Screens using Smart Technology Gain. Um, I'm going to be doing a demonstration of the Platinum 4K Cinema uh, versus uh, the Crystal H Technology Screen Paint. Um, the reason why I'm doing this is, uh, well actually I've been doing a few of these. Um, the reason why is because there's a few announcements and there's a couple of interesting things we didn't tell you about the Platinum 4K Cinema and the purpose of why it was designed. Alright, so... Um, the uh, the Crystal H technology screen paint is going to be discontinued very soon. Uh, the reason why is because um, we have been in, in negotiations with a particular company, which I'm not going to say, uh, due to the fact of our um, our NDA. Um, there is parts of that chemical um, that we had that, that that makes up the dark silver, which is. Um, in the process of being um, purchased by a, a another company, so um, it's um, it's not going to be used in a way you guys are thinking. Can't say too much about what's going on, but all I can say is that yes, soon you will not see a Crystal H dark silver screen paint anywhere. So you guys are probably thinking, okay, so what's next? Well. We have a screen called Platinum 4K Cinema, and the Platinum 4K Cinema made by Crystal Edge is the replacement, is the upgrade version of uh, the uh, Dark Silver. And like I said, we do our demonstrations, we don't tell you guys a lot of stuff. I told you guys we have a lot of business going on off YouTube that has nothing to do with YouTube. We just show you a few things here and there, but there's a lot of business going on. So, will it be in a screen paint form? No. Um, it is designed to be um, in a fixed frame projection screen or blackout cloth. Now here's a large sample of the Platinum 4K Cinema. There is the dark silver. We'll show you the difference between the two with the lights on and off to show you how advanced uh, the Platinum 4K is. Now, like I said, um, the particular parties that are involved in the uh, negotiations for the uh, dark silver um, they um, are not interested in any way of using it and the uh, matter in which it was intended to be used for. Um, but just trying to say this in particular words, use particular words um, that does not violate the NDA which we have signed. All right, so that's pretty much all I can say. All right, so let me move on from here and let me show you guys uh, the advancements of the um I've, I've done it on so many different levels but wait before we do this let's go downstairs and i'll show you if those of you have not seen uh the dark silver um not dark silver i can't say it <laughs> not so much screen anymore the platinum 4k cinema so this right here is a platinum 4k cinema this is 150 inch 169 uh, these screens will be sold in 150 inch sorry 50 inch 169 tabletop all the way up uh, to 150 inch and we do have it in a blackout cloth version also mind you the screen right here cannot be shipped overseas now what does that mean for my crystal edge technology dark silver screen upstairs well it means that I will be recoding my screen uh, to a platinum 4k cinema because like I said no point in having the screen if we are not going to be able to use it anymore all right so I show you guys a demonstration on the screens and the advancement so you know I've been kind of peppering peppering it throughout here and there and a few of the demonstrations I've been doing telling you guys that we have some changes coming uh, there's some updates coming we just signed our first NDA out of the five or six we've just signed and um yeah there is some serious changes coming
Now, in our last few demonstrations, yeah, we've been talking a bit about semi-gloss. Um, I did a demonstration of the screen uh, next to the uh, Crystal Edge Technology Dark Silver, and also so you can see where the semi-gloss hot spotted like crazy uh, next to our Dark Silver. That's one thing you don't have to worry about our screens. It's hot spotting. Now I think the last demonstration I'm going to be doing on that because I have to get back to work. I have so much work it's not even funny that I have to get to. But the next last demonstration we're going to do on that, we actually painted, we made our own cheap version. Uh, we made, it's just a cheap version of screen paint of a semi-gloss screen paint. We are going to be testing that on PVC and we're also going to show you that, you know, regardless, uh, the PVC is going to cause the screen to uh, peel and deteriorate even though it is a different format of paint. You can see the advancements already. This screen looks incredible. Now uh, the Platinum 4K Cinema is using uh, Smart Technology Gain Times 2. Like I said, it's a more advanced version of the, um, of the uh, Crystal Edge uh, Dark Silver. Now, what does that mean for our logo? A lot of people probably think, okay, so since you know, they're not, they don't care about the logo on our screen, uh, our cube, our crystal, they don't care about that. Um, all they care about is this uh, particular part of that, um, that formula. So, um, like I said, we'll have some people out there, some certain individuals that'll be trying to figure out what are they interested in, but trust me, you couldn't be, you you You'll be so far from it, it's not even funny. So far from it, it's not even funny. As I said before, when we design the, um, the Dark Silver by Crystal Edge, it is a, um, it is a four to five step um, combination of different forms of chemicals that make up that, 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 that paint. So it's a little bit more advanced than you think. That's why every time somebody tries to do a demonstration against it, we prove them wrong over and over again on our technology because um, they think they got us figured out and they just don't. So it's funny. And I'll explain to people, you know, don't ever think we're sleeping because we're not. We actually have quite a few individuals of importance of watching certain things for us. So later on in time, we can bring it to a head if you know what I mean, to a certain individual. I'm gonna put that out there so you know what's gonna happen. So look at this already, it looks fantastic. The screen looks incredible. I can't wait, so I have to redo my entire screen. I'm probably gonna do it today. I'm gonna redo the entire screen um, in a platinum 4K cinema. Also, too, I'm probably going to do that cheap, we call it the cheap, we call it um, um, the cheap screen paint. That's what it is, pretty much just like a cheap, cheap screen paint we designed uh, using the, um, I'm pretty sure a lot of people have probably done the exact same thing. They probably use the paint um, as a form of their screen paint, but we're going to test that particular mix against the uh, Future Tech 47AG. That screen's a beast. That screen will flatline any screen. Look at the blues. And we love to do this in a fully lit environment. As always, fully lit environment, this is how it's got to be done. Look at this. And as you can see, there is no hot spotting because we don't use semi gloss.
Now I just want to put this out there one more time. The Platinum 4K Cinema will not be a screen paint. It's not designed to be a screen paint. It'll be only designed for fixed frame projection screens. Also too, it'll be designed uh, for a blackout cloth. Now, we are working on getting a 120 inch 169 motorized tension uh, projection screen uh, for the uh, Platinum 4K Cinema and some other cool projects we're gonna be working on with that screen. Now, I'm going to come back here for a minute. Let me show you guys something really cool. I think I had that semi-gloss screen around here somewhere. Semi-gloss. All right, we're going to grab our Dolphin video. As I said before, before I even did the demonstration, I told you guys there are two colors that will cause the screen to hotspot like crazy. One is blue, and the other one is white. Where it is, there it is. There it is. This is the semi gloss screen right here. I'm gonna put that right there next to the platinum. There's our new platinum screen. Platinum, platinum, platinum. Put right there in front of the platinum. I don't want that falling over. All right, show the difference between the two. Now you see that blinding light right there in the center of the screen? That's the blinding light right there on the platinum screen. That, this is what semi-gloss does. Semi-gloss is a very, 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 very bad format to make a screen paint on because it will hot spot like crazy. Look at this. That's hot spotting. Now there's our screen right here. This is the new platinum. Platinum screen, no hot spotting, no hot spotting on the crystal edge. Now let's take our semi gloss screen, put it right here in the middle, right there. Now watch this. that glare in the middle of the screen right there that is semi gloss that's what semi gloss does that blinding light right there that's hot spotting see how it dims down and it'll get bright again there you go boom there we go that's why we don't touch it Bad idea, bad idea using semi gloss. This stuff will hot spot, like I said, like crazy. Put it back over here. Yeah, so that right there was our own semi gloss uh, screen paint mix that we used uh, using a little black uh, paint, a little bit of the, uh, the glitter. Um, that's what we used, and we call it the fairy dust. That's so we got it from there, and uh. That's the results from it. Now that's why, so this is how advanced the Platinum 4K screens are. Now you see the reds? They can produce better yellows, better reds. They look absolutely fantastic. And they have insane game capability. 
Okay guys, I'm Kenneth Burke from Crystal Ridge Technology Projection Screens using Smart Technology Game. Hope you enjoyed this video demonstration. I'd like to thank you all for watching. Ah yeah, and our update is really freaking interesting. Yeah, we have a lot going on off YouTube. I told you guys we have a lot of deals going on here and there. And it is going to be an interesting summer. Hope you guys enjoyed the video demonstration. I'd like to thank you all for watching.